Yeah, so my name is Barnabas Shelbourne. I'm the Chief Executive of Legacy Youth Zone in Croydon and my role will be to oversee the building, the day-to-day -day running, uh, making sure that we're running and providing engaging, exciting activities for young people and making sure we're meeting and working with the community, um, bringing in more people to be partners and, and raising income to make sure that we're always being exciting and providing fresh uh, things for young people to do. So I've been involved in youth work for since early 2000s. Um, I started working for a charity, started volunteering, um, got into it that way, and then you know really had a passion for actually enabling young people to uh, reach their potential really, and and then that you know there's something good in all young people, and that's progressed. And as I've uh, grown as a, an individual and in youth work, gone into different things, so provide, working like face to face and doing delivery that way, working one to one, working in schools, uh, working in lots of different youth work settings, running a youth cafe, doing detached work and so on. And then that's progressed into like management roles and overseeing teams and doing things like youth participation, having young people's involvement in things. And then to more of oversight roles, like uh, I was uh, in my previous role, strategic lead for children, youth, and family work, so overseeing a, a portfolio of different services provided. So, what I'm really excited about and um, was quite inspiring was the fact that Onside really um, want to invest in young people, their focus is on young people, it's about providing you know, a, a really safe place for them to hang out, uh, meet new people, be who they are, um, be challenged, um, learn new things, and I think. You know, for me, you know, I got into youth work because my passion was about helping and working with young people, and and that's what this charity is about: is really valuing and investing in the future of of um, our nation, and and particularly in Croydon. I think that's, you know, that's what I want to do. So I'm um, based in Wigan Youth Zone and visiting other youth zones in the northwest, finding out about how they run, finding out what activities they they provide, uh, finding out about the strengths and the, the things that we can develop and and do do um, in in Croydon and. Lake Legacy, um, meets, you know, finding out the, about the planning processes and the structures, and, and so on, meeting people that are working with um, Wigan Youth Zone as well to see if we can do similar things down in, in, in Croydon as well. So, just really absorbing things. So, that's the first six months, and then once that's over, I'll be coming back to down, down to the south and, and meeting new people in the community, um, really trying to meet patrons and get more people on board and build relationships. I think it's really exciting, I think the fact that it's open seven days a week, uh, providing 20 activities a day um, and open, basically when school's not open, the, the youth zone's open. Uh, the fact that you know, you've know you got a whole separate facility for boxing, for performing arts, for art, um, for arts and crafts stuff, for music, uh, a, a youth work area and, and a massive sports hall with the climbing facilities and the staff as well who have the expertise to provide that is, I think, is really, really amazing. And, and um, I, I, you know, believe that the young people in at Legacy, who, who become members of Legacy Youth Zone and in Croydon will really benefit from that.